Hi guys, it's Ariana. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to go through my entire wig collection with you guys. I'm going to show you every wig that I own and it's going to be fun. This is just my wig haul that I have. I've been collecting wigs for the last year and I've got about 18. <laughs> so without further ado, I'm going to show you guys every single wig I own.
is my entire wig collection. I have about 18 wigs. And they're glorious. <laughs> so as you guys saw in this video, um, some of the wigs that I have are on the costume side and some of them are more on the high end side. So I have wigs that range between $20 and $150. It really depends on the style of the wig, the quality of the wig, and whether or not it's a lace front wig. I've gotten some really, really nice lace front wigs for about $30 before, but it's a hit and miss. Sometimes you're, you will get a lace front wig that is so terrible, like this one, for example. You'll get a wig that it just doesn't work for you, and it was a lace front. I paid like I think it was about $90 for this wig and when I got it I was so upset because as you guys see with this wig it's a very similar style like it's the ringlet curls it's really pretty but this one when I put it on it kind of looks like I have ramen coming out of my head whereas this one looks a little bit more natural whereas they're the same it's the same quality it's just this one doesn't look good whereas this one looks really great so it really depends and then these wigs are definitely more of the costume wigs, as you can tell by the part in the front. It looks cheap, how shiny they are. They're just cheaper wigs. There is some do like things that you can do to your wigs. If you get a cheap wig like this and you love the color and you want to just rock it, it was only this wig was only thirty dollars, I believe. Um, you want to rock this wig? All you got to do is you got to take some dry shampoo, spray it down, and it'll get rid of some of the shine. So there's definitely things you can do to make costume wigs wearable. Like for example throw a hat on. I always throw hats on with my wigs. It's just something I like to do. You don't have to, but I prefer to. I love wearing I love wearing wigs with hats or toques or scarves or really anything. Anything that goes with the wig to accessorize it, I, I don't mind. I like wearing things with it and it helps bring the wig down because like as you guys can see, it's a little bit more proof poofy without the hat and then with the hat, it just kind of tames it and it just looks a little bit more natural and wearable whereas I just I like wearing too because I live in Canada but thank you guys so much for watching this video if you guys did like this style of video please let me know in the comments down below and I will definitely do more videos like this as my wig collection grows because I don't see me not buying wigs in the future I'm always gonna buy wigs I am so obsessed with them I love wigs <laughs> but if you guys have any questions comments or concerns about wigs I have an entire wig series that you guys can watch on YouTube, well what you're watching right now, you guys can watch. I will link the playlist down below for you guys if you guys are interested. I have tons of videos on how to brush a wig, how to wear a wig, how to style a wig, just tons of stuff like, well, maybe not on how to style a wig because I'm lazy and I just kind of buy wigs that are already styled. There's tons of videos on how to style wigs though on YouTube if you guys are interested, just type it into the search bar and a bunch of videos will come up, I promise. But. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys at my next one. Bye.